Yeah, you you guys ever sleep in for breakfast, nap for lunch, and then sleep for dinner again? Yeah, me neither. I haven't done that. <laughs> I'm gonna go over the power of harmonizing. Harmonizing is essential to all music making. If you listen closely to every single song, I guarantee you there's multiple layers. Here's my song, Daydreams. Here's the bridge. That is it by itself. That's the first bass layer. And it sounds all right. It sounds decent by itself, but it kind of feels empty. And so what I did was I added a layer that pans to the right of it, play it by itself. So instantly it already sounds more full. And then on top of that, I went an octave below because when you harmonize, you can go above or below forgot to mention that earlier and it just allows you to hit that full range of vocals instead of it just hitting straight in the middle so let's say your bass what you want it to actually sound like is right here if a listener listens to it it just comes at you straight on but let's say you want to go higher bam right here now it's going to be attacking from this angle too or lower attacks you from right here and so the listener gets that full experience of like, boosh, it's like a total wave, not just boop, not just low poke through the middle, lower and upper range. That's an eargasm. Added another layer, but this time it's an octave lower than the original bass. So here's what it sounds like. All right, and here's everything all together. If I helped you pass the time, please hit that like button and subscribe for more. I'm gonna be uploading every single day, okay? I need you guys to hold me to that though. It's gonna be tough. It's gonna be tough, but you know, we got so much free time in this quarantine. Alright, guys, join the Super Saiyan family, hit that subscribe button, and like always, I will see you tomorrow. Deuces.